it's Wednesday, so we're going to be having some fun in the office. We're going to do a demo on some lips, and then you're going to get to see me have a demo of something. I'm going to leave it a big secret. So later today, you're going to want to check into our live feed or come back to our Facebook page. But today, first thing in the morning is we're going to do some lips. So I'm going to just prep her with a little chlorhexidine. So we use this to help clean the area. One thing we always want to make sure of is like, I'll ask before, you don't have to answer, but I'll ask like, do you have a history of like oral herpes? Because we want to pre-treat you. So make sure if that's the case that you let me know before we do your lip filler so I can write you a prescription. Yes, Today, what we're going to do is we're going to use our Restylane Define. So it's my new favorite lip filler. Define has been FDA approved for nine to 12 months. Now the one hard thing about the lip area is because it moves so much, sometimes you might see that that filler might go away in like six to nine months, but she's had filler before. As you do that base of hyaluronic acid fillers, your filler is gonna last longer. The more times you get injected, the longer the filler is gonna last. Um, mine at this point lasts like two years, but everybody's different with how quickly it goes away. What I love about Define is it's probably in size wise the biggest filler that we carry. So somebody who's looking to get a lot more either bang for their buck, we can use less of the filler and have some left over for an, a second injection later on. Or somebody who's looking for a lot more volume, this would probably be your best choice. So we're gonna get started. And we have a lovely girl here who's just <laughs> So happy to get to help us out with this video. So, all right, <laughs> you're gonna pick your spot on the wall or look at Miss Kelly. Okay. We're gonna start with that upper lip. So she's wanting more fullness all around. Let's look here. And she wants her bottom lip to be a little bit poutier than her top lip. So that's what we're gonna work on. The other thing that I love about Define is that because it's a bigger filler, I don't have to use as much, but then also it's a very soft filler is the best way that I can say it. So you're not gonna feel your filler as much. Now filler can move for about eight to 12 hours and so we wanna take that into consideration. So after you get filler, you're not going to want to like eat a big greasy cheeseburger, open your mouth really wide, drink out of a straw, and we also keep ice on it. Okay. So now I'm gonna to go to her other side and we're gonna fill it. So we've used about 0.2. Sorry, I know my hand gets in the way of this video. Oh, you're fine. But I always try to lift that lip as we go because your results are more important than our video. <laughs> So one of the other nice things is I'll tell her like if her lips try to curl in today that she'll want to kind of roll that lip out, especially out in the corners because they try to roll down on us. We're going to go right in the center. I know that one's the worst. That one. And we're gonna come from the other side. And when I'm looking at you, it looks like we need to fill just a little bit more on this side. Mm -hmm. We filled symmetrical. So what I always do first is I'll fill symmetrically. Okay. And then I'm gonna hit this side over here just to turn that bottom lip down. Um, I'll fill symmetrically and then I'll go back and touch some areas up that I feel need it. And so we've only used half the syringe so far. So she'll be able to come back in and have a touch up or if she decides she wants an area bigger, then we'll be able to do that as well. And 
it's not too bad, right? It's no, tolerable. It's very tolerable. We put on some numbing cream before. Absolutely. I'm going to stand back. i got to look at her some, like, straight ahead. Oh, I think you're going to love these. So, this is a little under open for me. I'm just going to smush that little knot out of there a little bit. Okay, you're good. Come close. in front of the camera. No, I realized I should probably not walk in front of the camera. And some of that can be a little swelling too, so okay. we'll wait, but we may have you come back in and just hit that center. Okay. Again, just stay. Just to even it out if we good. need it. Okay. Okay. All right. So it's been fun, guys. Chat yes. back in later. <laughs> We're gonna do some fun stuff with the micropigmentologist. So oh. permanent makeup stuff. So come back in. All right. Bye. Thanks, guys.